That sound means it is time to verify and it's time to get to the bottom of a claim fueling debate and discord among two groups of people. Those who are and are not vaccinated against COVID-19. So here we go. You've seen variations of this claim circulating social media that given the occurrence of breakthrough cases, people who are vaccinated against COVID are just as likely to spread the virus as people who are not. Is that true? To verify, I talked to infectious diseases physician Chris Uhl with Atrium Health Wake Forest Baptist, and I looked into the apparent source of the claim in question. An October research study published in The Lancet. It examined what is called the viral load or how much virus you have. The study found COVID vaccination reduces the risk of contracting the virus, including the Delta variant, and it also lessens the length of the infection. Yet fully vaccinated individuals with breakthrough infections have a peak viral load similar to that of people who aren't vaccinated. Dr. Uhl said while that could be concerning from a transmission standpoint, the viral loads aren't apples to apples. While the peak viral load may be just as high, it turns out that people who've been vaccinated, the viral load decreases much quicker than it does in an unvaccinated person. So the time available to transmit is shorter, thus fewer cases transmitted. The other thing we found out is that when looking for actual viable, alive virus in people with these peak viral loads, harder to find. Dr. Uhl said, in other words, your immune system beats up the virus before it's detectable on a PCR test. He points out vaccinated college students who live together in residence halls tend to have low transmission rates, even with breakthrough cases. And the risk of transmission in vaccinated households is 50% less than in unvaccinated households. So the good news is that even though your peak viral load may be high, that not all that virus viable and it is harder to transmit COVID if you've been vaccinated. Not impossible, but it's harder. But if we wear masks, we take that risk down even more if we're wearing those masks in an indoor situation. In conclusion, we verify no vaccinated people aren't just as likely to spread the virus as people who are unvaccinated. Even if they contract breakthrough infections, those infections are shorter and contain less live virus. And all that said, breakthrough infections remain rarer than infections among people who are unvaccinated. The CDC notes unvaccinated people are nearly six times as likely to contract COVID and 14 times more likely to die from it. You can help stop the spread of misinformation. If you see a claim or story that needs to be verified, send a selfie video or short paragraph to verify at WFMY.com.